Hey guys, what is up and welcome to Vlogmas Day 12. It is Vlogmas Day 12, so I actually just got back from work. It is currently 5.27 and I am exhausted. I stayed an hour and like 15 minutes extra because they were really short. Hella tired since I got there at like 6.15. I got like shake base in my hair, so I think I'm actually going to do like a spa night. I think I'm going to put on a face mask. I think I'm going to take like a bubble bath with like bubble bore, not a bubble bore, a bath bomb. That's what I was trying to say. Um, I'm gonna edit yesterday's vlog. It is us decorating the tree and me making Christmas cookies. They actually turned out really, really well. They're hella good, the sugar cookies though. I'm gonna eat one after I finish. But I have exciting news. I got an A in geography. And if you guys have watched my vlogs for the last few days, you guys know I was like completely stressing about it. Like I was so much freaking out because I wanted to get straight A's my last semester at my AA degree. And I think with the way it's going so far, I think I am. Um, I have an A currently in philosophy and geography. I have a 101 in my horse of appreciation class and I have like a 98 in my FAPA class. So I'm really excited. Geography I think was literally like a 90, probably exactly a 90. Um, I got an 88 on my final, which is fantastic because it was my first ever cumulative, cumulative final. I cannot say that word. Um, so it was a really big final and I was really stressing about it, but I did really good. Um, and I'm so happy you guys like, oh, it is finally over. Like, I'm so excited. And my cat is just being a little bit needy. But yeah, so I think I'm going to award myself with the spa night. Um, I have a final tomorrow, but it's in my FAPA class, and I'm not too worried about it, considering it's at 11 o'clock tomorrow. So I'll just wake up like 8.30, 9 o'clock, and just study for like an hour or so. I'm not like really too worried about it. Um, but yeah, so I'm really, really excited. I am really happy. Um, and it's really major step for me. Um, I think I'm gonna try, I haven't posted a video yet this week. Um, so I think it's gonna be my room transformation video. Um, if everything goes well and nothing happens with my vlog, or not my vlog, but like my SD card situation. Um, but yeah, so I also ordered my mom another gift yesterday and I'm going to try go to the mall tomorrow and maybe order her something as well. I do have to go to the mall tomorrow because I have to pick up a few, um, one last minute gift for my, one of my friends that we're doing a gift exchange this Sunday for. Look at what my cat is doing. He's literally standing on the chair. Like this cat of mine and snow. Look at what he is doing, you guys. <laughs> so, and then I also have to order two other gifts for my friends. And that I'm also doing a gift exchange for this Sunday. And I'm going to see if I can get maybe like something else for my mom. And we shall see. But I'm going to end this clip. And I'm going to get ready. I'm really tired, so I'm going to relax a little bit and just like, you know, de-stress. And I'll talk to you guys in a little while. My cat almost fell off the table. <laughs> what is up, you guys? It's like an hour or so later. Um, my vlog miss video from yesterday is currently um, exporting, or yeah, exporting. Um, so far, it seems to be completely doing okay. Um, but you know, I've learned not to trust my computer so far because this is yesterday was I think the second or third time that it hasn't read my SD cards so I'm a little bit confused um I think it's a 32 gigabyte like I said in yesterday's vlog that's not working but honestly I really don't know because one of um the clips from yes from this vlog that I'm uploading now was from that SD card and so far it's been able to read so I don't know if my if it's my SD cards or if it's iMovie or what's going on honestly um it seems to be doing fine now thank goodness um but i'm tired i was kind of falling asleep on my couch so that's why i got up and started editing yesterday's vlog because i was like i really can't afford to take a nap right now um, i'm gonna print off everything i need to know for my FAPA exam i probably might study a little bit tonight but honestly i'm not too worried about it um and yeah Oh crap, I just remembered 
Thank goodness I just remembered. I have to uh, finish my rough draft of my final exam. Yow, that would have sucked if I would have forgotten it. Okay, as soon as I'm done this, I'm going to like put a little reminder of myself and like sticky note it that I have to edit that or revise it. Thank God I just remembered because that actually would have sucked. Like, oh my freaking God. Oh. See, this is why you vlog, because you remember things. So I'm going to do that really quick, and then I'm going to take a bath, I'm going to take a shower, I'm going to do a face mask because I've started to get a little bit of dump bumps from just like leaning and stuff. And I think I'm going to call it a night, and maybe we'll put like some popcorn on, and maybe watch like a Christmas movie or something. And that will be my night, but I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. I'm going to edit it. Oh, not edit. I've already edited, edited, uploaded it. I can't speak. Third update of the night. It's like 8 o'clock, 7.57, pretty much 8 o'clock exactly. I just finished revising my two FASA papers. FASA. I need to go to bed. Um, FAPA papers. Um, it was easy. It took maybe like half an hour or something like that. Not even. Mostly... I lost all my citations that I used for my paper, so I had to refine them all over again, which... Wait a minute. I'm a fucking idiot. I literally thought I deleted my citations, but coming to find out, I just found them on the side of my desktop computer. This is what I mean about fail like literally just epic fails whatever i'm not redoing that it was pretty much all right anyway hi babes so i'm pretty much done all my homework i'm gonna print out what i need to study for tomorrow and i am going to take a bath and relax so i'll talk to you guys later i wanted to update you guys finals week you guys it's almost freaking done and i'm so excited like i can't wait Hey guys, what is up? I literally look like the Grim Reaper with my black hood on from like Billy and Mandy. If you guys remember that show, give this a thumbs up. But I just took a shower and I took a bath and I just relaxed because I was really sore because I did a really long shift today. Um, but I decided to end this Vlogmas with a story time video and I haven't told this story before because it actually um, just happened recently. If I actually can remember when it happened. I don't know the exact week. It happened in November. I think like I think like the week of November thirteenth or something like that. Um I had a kidney infection and um it was probably the most painful experience of my life. Um I almost ended up going to the hospital um because my mom and her fiance thought I might have had an appendix. Um issue an appendix burst or something and for that you really do need to go to the hospital because at first we couldn't figure out what it was um that week um it was tuesday so tuesday i woke up and i wasn't feeling that good um there was this really sharp pain on my side but i really couldn't like pinpoint like you know where it was i thought it was because i started doing stretching and you know i thought i pulled something um, and I took ibuprofen, so then I went to work, in like a couple of hours, um, I felt really, really bad, I got super pale, um, if you guys don't know, I mentioned it in a previous vlog, I have an issue of randomly passing out, um, the doctors don't know what it is and stuff like that, so, wish I could tell you, but really don't know, um, but I know the feeling of it, so I felt myself about to pass out, um, the pain on my side wouldn't go away even though I took ibuprofen um, and I did not feel good so um, I went home early and as soon as I came in I TMI I threw up um, whatever I had in my stomach and I laid down and I finally eventually fell asleep um, it really hurt to fall asleep because my side was hurting me again but I really I, I took ibuprofen again and it's it helped and I was able to go to bed and I woke up I had a heating pad I was rotating it um then Wednesday I felt a little bit better I missed all of my classes except for the um my geography exam but I slept like the entire day um I wasn't up for it at all um then Thursday I left work again early 
um i felt a little bit better i took ibuprofen though but i did feel better so i was like okay maybe it went away whatever it was um and then friday came and i went to school and i came home and it was a nightmare um my mom finally looked at where i thought the pain was coming from and it wasn't my hip it was my kidneys um so i started i was just about to take antibiotics actually when um the pain got so bad i mean like someone stabbing me with like pitchfork or something like that it was burning it was like a burning from the inside to the outside it was unbelievable you guys i would not wish it on my worst enemies um i laid down on the couch and no matter where i laid it hurt so badly i took four ibuprofen two antibiotics and i took two a leave yeah but as soon as i took the two a leave i threw up again damn i um whatever i had in my stomach from the last and keep in mind this entire week i pretty much did not eat except for chicken noodle soup that's pretty much all i ate um friday saturday was the first day i had anything substantial in my stomach and even then it was like not much but friday so i threw up a couple more times throughout the night i finally went to bed at like 11 30 um and i had the heating pad and stuff like that and then so saturday so my mom so i took antibiotics friday saturday sunday monday tuesday and wednesday um and then after that it finally got better um i don't have any more issues with my kidneys thank the gods um we don't necessarily know what it was caused by um but you know we have it in my family it's hereditary so we think maybe i got it from that but we don't know where we got it from but yeah that was a story time of the time i almost ended up going to the hospital because um my mom and her fiance thought i might have had an appendix issue um because usually for kidneys you don't really throw up and stuff like that so that's why they were concerned but i didn't go to the hospital that was a check mark because i hate hospitals they just creep me out um but yeah so i'm going to end this vlog now i hope you guys enjoyed this little story time i haven't told it before because not because i didn't feel like it but because it never really came up um i felt fine enough to make videos and stuff like that so that's pretty much all you guys saw but i will see you guys again tomorrow with another vlogmas and i will see you guys very soon and i love you guys i'm really delusional right now because i'm tired i will see you guys tomorrow bye